Hey guys, Pandorth here. Today I'm going to be playing the Luto demo. This game is honestly just on my Steam library. I don't even remember ever downloading the demo for it. Um, it just says coming soon. It's on Steam, but there is a demo for it. It's a horror game where you're trapped in your house and you're trying to find a way out, I guess. I don't know. Um, but, you know, looking for spooky games and stuff, I must have come across it. And I was looking at my Steam library like, what spooky games do I have? And it's Ludo. So honestly, it could just be a cursed game that ends up on my Steam library. That ends up cursing me to die or something because I don't remember where it came from. It just kind of showed up. And that's how a lot of horror things start, right? It's like, I don't know where this thing, I, I just kind of found it one day. So I figured, why not play it? I am literally in a horror movie right now. I'm like, I found a game on my Steam library. It's the old school version of I found a, a disc in an alleyway or something like that. I found this old VHS in an abandoned building. It's like, no, I found a random horror game on my Steam library. And then I was like, you want to be fun? Let's play it. So this is probably my downfall. So let's hop right into it and see what happens. Luto demo, the choice. The demo is a standalone experience, a representation of what Luto will be. We hope you enjoy it as a small game in its own right. Please note that we are still in development and that the demo is a premature version of the game. You are likely to encounter some bugs and unstable performance. We are still working hard to improve the final experience. Important, this demo has no save system, which means there's going to be death. Great. If I die, I lose my shit. Got it. Okay, but it's a standalone experience, which, I mean, a demo should be. It should always just be a standalone thing because you don't want to, um, you don't want to ruin the initial bit of your actual game because... A lot of the demo, I feel like a lot of the demos I play nowadays um, are usually like you, like uh, the one I just played um, with the uh, cursed bed. Uh, you start off at the very beginning of the game and you play and then you die. I don't know if that's its own standalone thing or if that's how the game is actually going to start. And I feel like back in the day, a lot of demos would start you like in the game. It wouldn't start at you at the beginning. It wouldn't start you at the end. But you'd be just like, you would be midway through the playthrough, like just entering the hospital, like in Resident Evil, I feel like you'd be like starting the demo, entering the hospital and trying to figure out what all is going on. Whereas when you actually played the game, the hospital would be like two hours in. So there wouldn't be too many spoilers, but it would just give you some of what the heart is going to be like. But having a demo on its own, that way it doesn't really spoil anything, I think is a great fucking idea because then you get to see what the game is like without ruining it um options well it's great because immediately i'm not being deafened by music sound i can actually adjust the sound on top of the fact that it's not deafening which is great immediately I already love this fucking demo ludo the choice let's go let's go it's very beautiful and i, I dig the cinematic bars on the top and bottom oh that's just immediate Okay, here we are. This game though, ironically, as much as it looks great and I dig the cinematic view, it's doing the same but opposite feeling that I get with field of view. I love wide field of views and this has given me a great field of view. This is like the perfect field of view. I'm not just cramped vision and stuff, but the bars limit my field of view up and down and I've never had that happen before in the sense of like my brain's like oh god what like oh my god I want wider field of view but up <laughs> this is f gorgeous like that alone is fucking beautiful I want this as a desktop background it doesn't even look creepy like it just looks it looks like you went to visit your grandma and her house she's just got her lights off and stuff you know okay oh god random choppiness though a little monkey. Yeah, he's cute. Well, that's odd. I don't know if there is, like, any specific thing I'm going to be trying to do. These are strange. Grandma, you got some weird stuff on your wall. Record. Oh, this is definitely, like, mine or a sibling's room. Windy day outside. Honestly, I like the stickers on the door. I just like that as a little added detail. This, I don't care. Like, this looks fucking beautiful. Those are strange. At least it blatantly tells me what I can interact with. A drawing of a door has... Drawing of a door with broken bars. Okay. Whoa. What was that? That was an interesting way of putting it in my inventory. A little, like, burn off. Visual burn. 
I don't know what it's actually called. So this is just gonna be very like movie-esque, isn't it? I'm, I dig it. It looks beautiful. You got the bars. You got transitions of things going in your inventory. I am all for it. And I can run. Sweet. Can I jump? No. Can I crouch? Oh. Hey, how are you? Are you doing better? It's been a while since, you know. No, I don't know. Amnesia. Yeah. I, I'm trying to give you space. But of course, if, if you need me, just say something. Okay? Oh, Why is there help and everything? Also, can I dial out? Oh, everything changed and it's dark and spooky. I can dial out? Help? Oh, the buttons actually go down? Okay, that's that's cool. I like that. All right, I get it. Okay, things got real spooky. It's was this always this? Uh, I didn't get, I didn't look right because I thought there was a wall here. I wanted to look around more, but the phone was ringing, and I didn't want to be rude. Oh God, it's so dark I can't see anything over there. And now there's chains and no more rocks in the. Oh gosh. So this says, "Do not stare at him." Help. There's nothing that I noticeably see that I can interact with. So I'm assuming if I see a guy, to not look at him. You know what? I like this room. I'm gonna stay in here. <sighs> Don't need the creaking of the floors. Zoom. Oh, I can zoom. What? Can I close door? Hey, just don't feed them after midnight, all right? We'll be fine. Okay. That's interesting. I like the detail of the paper and stuff. That look that just looks cool. Man, everything about I'm not gonna get over these visuals. This shit looks this this game is beautiful. The hallway is full of boxes from the move. Oh. That drawing should not be in that box. Who is calling? Nowhere. Wait, do I not who know who that girl is? Chains? Question mark? This is not a normal house. Why does it smell like iron? The path is open, but the picture is gone. Use? Yet? Yeah. Drawing of a door? Behind the bars is a dark place. Easy to get lost. All because of this unwanted gift? What lies beyond the light? Up the staircase to be happy? Left or right, which will be the good one? Walking among strangers, I think I want to give it back. Okay. So is this like, is this gonna be a multi like ending? And the reason it said that is there's not gonna be save files is because of the fact that you have to replay to do the different endings. Also, I'm liking The Exorcist, you got The NeverEnding Story, you got E.T., you got Beetlegeist, I'm assuming Jaws. I don't know what they all are. That one looks like Scream. That one... Robin Williams. That's fucking... Oh, God! Oh, Jumanji! Holy shit! That's awesome. Casper? I don't know what that one is. I'm not sure what that one is. New film. Chucky, Wednesday, uh, I think that's one of the gremlins, right? After stuff have the zombies. I'm not sure about that one. Construction paper. Those look like the same outlines as the picture right there. So I'm literally just, am I creating a movie and like this is my imagination and like making it a reality? Something happened over here when I placed that. That's dark as fuck. So I'm going to keep going the other way where the light is. Maybe I can pick up this flashlight and use it. Flashlight. Thank you. Yeah, this is not a normal house. That is safe to say. Okay, so something definitely happened. I like this room the most. It's cool. It, it gives me memories and nostalgia of movies, but also it has light. So I'm assuming I would need like a crowbar for that stuff. Oh, this is a door with broken bars. Uh, some lag, but also spooky stuff. Okay. So left or right, which one is the good choice? I'm gonna go right first. Well, that one has a has an actual photo with no chain. This one has a bad photo with a chain. So I'm gonna go left first. Give me the good ending. That's definitely not misleading, right? Up the stairs to good was the drawing, I believe. So I'm going up the stairs, going down the stairs. Going up the sideways stairs. It's a blue book over there with an eyeball. 
I am looking down upon where I once was. Oh, fuck. What? What is this style? It looks like a comic book, but also not. What? So there's a tape at the window. That's the window that I just saw behind me, right? That's that. There's, there's that right there. But I can't do anything with this, but that has a lot of VHSs. This is This is so strange. Yeah, I see a door on the other side, and then that's the blue VHS tape. Guess I'm going the other way. I'm going right instead. I like that it shows me from a distance what I can interact with just to make my life easier of not sitting here like, can I interact with this? Can I interact with this? Can I interact with this? Also, the ceilings are so high that's just the abyss. Got it. They are no longer here. I don't believe you. I, d I don't know who they are, but I'm pretty sure they are still here. Also, I'm going down instead of up where the VHS is. Is this going to be a thing where I go down, but I end up up? You just Febreze my ass, you dick. I guess I got you. I got you. That whispering, is that a radio? <sighs> there is no escape here. Seek help elsewhere. Help me. Help. 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 Are these me doing in a past experience? Help, 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 help. Somebody needs help, but I don't know who. I am lost. Help me. I... Did I say help me? I wasn't paying attention when the subtitles happened. Help. Pretty sure he's saying help me and not just help, but it's okay. Well, that's some kind of Triforce bullfuckery. I don't know what you want. Well, I know what you want, obviously, but I also don't know what you want. Uh, well, I don't see anything to interact with. Oh, shut your face. Maybe a door unlocked or something back here. Are you gonna poof me? Yep. Was it, what the hell just happened? What? I looked down for a second and you're freaking the camera out, man. Don't do that. Oh, this door is open now. Got it. Oh, boy. Guess I'm going to the light door. Can't interact with you. Sorry, you're trapped in there for now. Ooh, I didn't know if I should look or if I should... Oh, don't look at him. I don't know what I'm doing. Am I running? Okay, I'm gonna run. I, I was told not to stare at him. Uh, don't look. Was it me? Was I under the sheet the whole time? Be careful with this place. It's not... It's easy to get into. What? What? This looks, this looks great. This is, this is such a beautiful experience. But also what? I got chased by a ghost man. I, I never thought I'd get chased by a guy in a sheet or a ghost in a sheet. I really don't know which one it was. This is so surreal. And yeah, there's obviously a little bit of a jump scare aspect, but it's not super like, it hasn't been super reliant on it, which is nice. Smiley face, well that, that's clearly a good thing, right? It's a smiley face. Can I close the door behind me? No, got it, okay. Oh boy. You won't do it again. You won't do it again. You won't do it again. All right, well, I don't know what I won't do again. This is clearly a broken mirror, but, well, is it a mirror? It looks like a, yeah, it looks like it's, no, it's not a mirror because that's not the same layout. That's the room I was already in once. So I was, I could be watched. Things he likes, movies, drawings, dinosaur, horror, weird. Boys, pain, his dog. Five, two, two, drawing of a dark path. I hate that that bag looks like a smiley face. This was like a one way mirror. I don't remember there being anything on this wall. I thought it was just a wall. No, it was one of these boards. It was one of those, but it's see-through? You cheeky bastard. What I remember. Oh God, I can rotate. But that's what I remember. He hasn't drawn anything original for a long time. He just draws the movies he likes over and over again. I still don't understand why he keeps drawing like that. It doesn't match his age. He seems stuck in an unreadable past somehow. He looks happy, but why? He's been left alone and no one is paying attention to him. After all he's been through, he should be crying. That's what I remember. I, and then I am sorry on the bottom of the page with the little checkerboard because why not? Why I hate you? Selfish, fat, ungrateful. Your brother died hating you. Had ke he keeps looking at me. I trusted you. 
The divorce was your fault. No one wants to play with you. Sissy boy eat dicks. What is happening? Stop watching me. And then I covered it up with the paper. That, okay. I miss him. There are so many mixed signals going on here. Man. Oh. This room was locked before. That's what it is. Oh, that genuinely was a mirror. Okay. Gotcha. And then I got a, a, a note with 522. 522. This wasn't... Was this open before? Oh, boy. Oh, this is a weird layout. It's going to get trippy real... Well, I mean, it's already gotten trippy, but it's going to get real trippy real fast. Drawing of a blue gift. Okay. Oh, do I? No, I still have to go put pictures on the wall, don't I? Like, I'm putting things together, right? Please don't kill me and make me have to, like, redo this. So, walking among strangers. Well, that, that one's it. What lies beyond the light? Left or right? Choice will be the good one. Well... That one has two different stairs on it. Walk among strangers. And I can just put you on without, but I can't move other things. Oh, seven, four, five, two, two. Oh, seven, four. I'm just going to screenshot that and hopes it's important because I got nothing else. I like this room. It just, this room is comforting. I like that they gave you a comforting room. I don't know if I'm supposed to wander around helplessly or if it's gonna guide me with locked doors. The chains actually move, got it. That's clearly puzzle-esque. And then there was the, um, oh, what the hell was it called? Triforce type of thing on the fish. So I do not stare at him. I'm assuming that's the ghost that I do not stare at, but I guess there's no real getting away from him. Just random bits of choppiness will just zoop, do that. Like, I'm staring this way, I'm up here now. <laughs> All right, so. Left gave me to that door with the eye. I'm just gonna repeat my steps because I have a code now. Maybe something else unlocked. Yeah, I'm assuming doors are just gonna unlock as I cycle through, like this one did at the bottom of these stairs. That door is wide open now. I can't interact with that one. I ran that way and it was nothing. So I guess I'm gonna go for this door again and hope he doesn't just decide to reappear and close the door. He literally face planted into the door. It was kind of hilarious. Wait, uh, and then this just leads me back to the way I just came. So this is a quicker route, got it. Mentally mapping out my location. Uh, I don't see anything, so I can't do anything with this hallway. So I'm gonna go back to the Triforce room, I guess. I'm trying to think if there was any doors that I couldn't come up. Poof. Uh, if there was any doors that I've come across that I uh, couldn't open before that might be able to now. I don't, I don't know if I'm supposed to look for little triangles, you know, as like the, to put in there, but there's, that's the second door that's had a puzzle-esque thing on it. I haven't really been able to interact with anything to like open things in the sense of drawers. I don't recall anything new. I can't just, oh, I don't want to touch that. That's live. That's a bad idea. Oh, I can probably. Oh, seven. Oh, wait, I'm trying to hit the buttons over here. 074522. Oh, that's not. I did one. I, uh, oh, seven, four, five, two, two. I spy with my little eye. The door. A little thing. A little. I spy. With my little eye, a little thing, and a little.